my brother, my sister, there on the mountain where you are arrested by the words of your master and coming more and more to see and hear his heart. I pray that this will be an excellent year for you, together with him, for knowing him that is eternal life. Now I'm reading for you from Matthew 5, with the Sermon on the Mount, just verse 1 and 2. And seeing the multitudes, he went up on a mountain, and when he was seated, his disciples came to him. Then he opened his mouth and taught them, saying, With that, the only thing, first of all, that I need to say, want to say, is it was all God's initiative. When seeing the multitudes, God seeing you, He wants to go and sit and teach you, share with you His heart. Go and sit with Him and do that. The disciples of Christ, the guys that were following His agenda, go and sit with His agenda, not go and sit there with your agenda for 2021. Go and hear his heart, his agenda, as you are challenged as a disciple of Christ to walk in maturity. Not as many times the world would think maturity is knowing a lot, knowing that you are right, but mature, but that you will be mature enough to be challenged about what you think is right. That's maturity. May God help you, may God help me. In that place also was people with purpose, understanding the blessings of God. Because as God opened his mouth and he taught them, then the next ten verses is all will all be about blessed are these guys, blessed are the guys that are like this, happy, fortunate, to be envied. But in all of this, God bless them because he wants to be blessed. He wants to bless himself by blessing you. Because if, as a father, he wants you to enjoy life. He wants you to be happy and be fulfilled. And as a father, then he is fulfilled as he see. He's seeing that his children, they are fulfilled. May you come into that place to be part of those people with purpose. People with purpose that understands also the position of blessings in their lives, the purpose of blessings in their lives. That is not the end result, God that wants to bless you, but God blessing you for a purpose, for a specific future and destiny. And that in that, you will find the fulfillment, not in the blessing itself, but in what you accomplish through the blessing, that your fulfillment will be there with your God. Go and sit with your God in this season and know that He's excited about you and your future.